I am not years. ever living through another hurricane. <laughs> that is not happening. I don't know where we're going to go. Uh, honestly, I don't know where would I go. But I am never doing that again. That is, that was, that's it. Sitting in my attic while the water filled up my house. <laughs> that is just not something that you want to be doing again. The boardwalk to me is like the greatest thing in the world. You know, I walk on the boardwalk, I say every day, maybe four times a week. And in the winter, when I'm walking on the boardwalk, I feel like I'm skiing on the boardwalk. You know, and I feel, I don't even ever have to really go on vacation. I do travel and I do go places. But walking on the boardwalk is like being any place in the world. And to me, it's, it's my favorite. So now it's gone. And all the naysayers, oh, that boardwalk isn't going to be here for five years. We're never, they're never going to put it up. And then you hear it's going to be this blacktop thing, you know, all this negative speculation of what it's going to be. And if, it, if we get it at all, you know, and I'm missing it and I'm longing for it. You know. And then they put up this spectacular looking boardwalk that's beyond uh, anything I could have ever imagined before time you know, uh, on schedule, before schedule, and it's just fantastic. I love my community. There are things I don't like what gets done. I don't really like that the boardwalk came first and we came second. Because the, the boardwalk is a beautiful $45 million boardwalk, but our infrastructure's crumbling. You know, I think, um, the fact that the city did such a great job was not an accident, okay. right? I think that the administration really was geared up and ready to go. Naturally, you can never, this is, a, this is an epic storm that you don't anticipate. You prepare. So I actually asked the question, well, is there a plan for Nassau County? And he said, no, there was no plan. This was, this was the era of shrinking government and that people had to plan for themselves. And I was really shocked and kind of ticked off at this answer. You know, unfortunately, with a lot of these past storms we had, Irene and even going back to 1985 to Gloria, a lot of people evacuated. We told them to evacuate, and they didn't leave. And nothing really happened. So it became the boy that cried wolf. Well, the storm, we had a lot of people hiding in their attics because that was the only place that was safe in their house. And then once the water receded, they were able to get out. I would never have thought a storm like this could happen. You know, it was always if and not when. But, you know, could all the planets align again and something like this happen? I, I'm, I would be crazy to say it wasn't possible. You know, and I think everybody needs to pre be prepared for that. And if there is another warning, we need to heed that warning. And when we tell people to evacuate, I, I think the next time they will evacuate.